Hello guys, welcome to a new episode of Surviving Mars. Um, before I started releasing the other videos, I decided that the way I was going to play this game was going to be so totally different to everybody else out there. However, Sky has beat me to it. Um, he's basically started a, uh, a, a 475, I think it is, difficulty. Um, and I want to play on a difficult level, uh, just so that I can actually try out... Uh, what I can actually do now. He's already gone through all these different options to work out which is the, the worst to go with and I think it was this futurist this futurist um, So we get the autonomous sensors uh, and sensor towers no longer require power or maintenance, so That's fine. We can live with that um, We're gonna go with a don't panic because I think it will be a lot of panic at this sort of level um, He started doing the Mars gate so I thought well Quite fancy, uh, I'm not sure about the last war, but the next hardest is Wildfire. So I'm going to go with that one. Um, and we will jump straight in. Now, payload, I'm going to knock off the uh, moisture vapor, uh, va uh, vapor uh, moisture evaporator. Get it right. I'm going to keep the fuel refinery because I'm going to need that up and running. Um, and I'm also going to keep the drone hub. Uh, actually, do you know what? I'm knocking that off for this time. I'm going to keep the fuel refinery. I want my explorer. Uh, we've got four drones. Um, so let's just knock these down just slightly. See what we can get them down to. Come on, one more. There we go. I can get my explorer. Let me explore my transporter and we'll use that. So that's going to be our first rocket, a purely a um, fuel. What's it called again? Fuel refinery. <laughs> uh, a rover, explorer, a transporter, only three drones, polymers, and um, machine parts, electronics. So very few of those. So let's go to next. Um, you should be able to customize your map locations and this was pointed out on skies um one of his teams there or one of his um con uh, comments on there um so this will give me a difficulty bonus of 485 percent uh we're okay for metals water and concrete that's not too bad but we have got a level three dust devils level three dust storms <laughs> cold waves like nobody's business and we have meteorites hmm. now Cl uh, Sky's gone and placed himself smack bang in the center there um, but uh, yeah I, spot I spotted that in the comments so I thought let's give that a try um, I suppose if I went on a different mission that would actually be uh, if I uh, yeah if I went on a different mission that would be just slightly harder but at the end of the day when you're playing at a hard percent no matter what you're playing at it's going to be hard and this is going to be absolutely rock hard so let's just get see see how we get on um as there's so many people out there playing this already uh, i'm going to try and keep this uh, episode very brief and to the point Welcome um, to Mars. thank you um okay so that is let's close that off i don't really need to see all that oh my life all i have got is concrete and a bit of metal that's not great so I'm gonna land my spaceship doesn't really matter where let's just go back into uh, full view so we have got uh, let's have a look let's start scanning the areas around um, looking at this we've got one two three four sections but we've also got this really really cold area um, yeah that is going to be really interesting to play. Um, so let's see what we can actually do. So we're going to have a, a few little bit of metal around about anyway. Um, so we're going to have to start building things up really, really slowly. Yeah, we know the controls. Thank you very much. And don't need that. Thank you. All right. So our rover's off. Our, ex our explorer. And yeah, let's take him out here. And we can start getting this guy to start picking things up. Uh, we've got a couple of drones, so let's just get ourselves some storage locations. Um, we're going to put down uh, metal 
Uh, we'll put down polymer because we will have those on board. We also need to get the other components off the ship. So we'll just drop that down. So they'll deal with that. Uh, so they'll get the 10 polymer, the 10 electronics and the um, machine parts off, which is fine. It's going to take us a while. So what I'm going to do is we'll just speed forward because we're not going to be able to make a great deal uh, early in the game. Uh, so we can build. Let's have a look what we can build production. Uh, we can build concrete extractor. We need two machine parts. So how this uh, concrete extractor works is the white section that you can see is where the actual uh, roller will go out to try and start clearing concrete so you can see in the stats over here as you hover over it it'll tell you roughly how much you're going to get out of that pile um, obviously sometimes it'll, yeah, so look we can't go there so to be perfectly honest uh, that's not too bad uh, yeah we'll go there we'll get that built we're also going to build a sensor because we have already uh, had that made available to us and that will speed things up quite immensely uh, let's drop that down and set that as a higher priority now we haven't got any water so we can't make any fuel so that's kind of uh, we're kind of stuck in that sense but looking around we have got quite a lot of area that is nice and flat uh, but as uh, we saw before it's got a lot of uh, flat areas or not flat areas we've got a lot of uh, oops let's get our research running I haven't checked that oh you idiots right okay um, magnetic fields I'm not worried about that yet so that drone swarm drones homes can be constructed with two additional drones uh, and the drone maximums is up to 80 okay um, mm. I'm not worried about that just yet. We do have uh, that that's already researched. We have got um, extractor fuel that's already researched, so we don't need to worry too much about that. I think, starting off, I think we're going to stick with uh, Drone Swarm. Um, yeah, I think we are. And let's see how we get on. Right, uh, as I say, speed this up. Um, so we're going to build our sensors so that will make a massive difference on our actual scanning so we've got like a 335 percent boost there etc so that won't be too long um, and we are building our concrete extractor so we might as well just get a, a concrete depot behind there and just leave that as that okay uh, we need power now I'm going to stick with my solar panels. I've got a bit of metal now, which is good, and I'm not really going to be worrying too much uh, at this early stage. I think it's cold. They can work in the cold, so I'm going to drop you here, um, and we will. Oops. Get rid of you. And build another one, and we'll put our wires going down. take that over and to there perfect so we'll get power running so only when it's daylight will this uh, concrete extractor run uh, but that's uh, not a problem uh, you can go and unload oops and then you can go also Sector go and... scanned. all right so we've got a bit more polymer over here we haven't got any anomalies which is not great but we can send our little transport over to go and collect whatever uh, is available all right that looks like it come on go and collect thank you don't need that we'll put our explorer near our wire because it doesn't have to be on top of it and we're going to re-associate these oh, I want you they're going quite far, so they're actually bringing this lot down, so we, we can leave them as where they are. Right, so he's got those three polymers. And we can drop those off. Okay, so. Not worried about that. Come over here, how much have we got? 
19 metal. Right, let's go and collect all that. And then we can assign Mask these drones. Achieved. Sector scanned. Anomaly Perfect. found. Perfect. Let's just pause that and get our explorers to go and look at that. We've got two waters. So we've got 5,000 and we've got 5,000. So that's not really big deposits. But we have also got... Have we got more metal? Let's have a look in the map. So we've got uh, 67 metal and 8 polymers. So that's not too bad. Okay. Oh dear. This is going to be fun with these things. I'm not entirely sure how it will respond or react with our drones and our um, trans uh, other other vehicles. So it could be quite interesting. Just going to reassign all these drones to the explorer. We don't need them going out too far um, at this moment in time. Um, yeah, okay, that'd be quite interesting. Right, so you're fully loaded. Let's get that dropped off. And then we can go and see where we can find these. Now, that's 19, Anomaly so that's... Analyzed. Okay. Alright, so let's have a look at what we actually got for that. So, that gave us... Uh, did that give us anything? Hmm. Unless it just gave us the boosts for these two so we've got the drones faster and we've also got the cargo space increase which is kind of useful if we had a load of money but we don't have a load of money so we're gonna have to wait and see um, right that's not running at night which is fine and looking at this the way I find it easiest to find things to harvest or collect is to put this over them and anything yellow is something you can actually send Sector your vehicles scan. in Anomaly to uh, uh, collect. So that is quite useful. So we've got stuff there. All right, so we've got another anomaly. Let's go and have a look at that. And we've got another 19 um, metal on there. These guys aren't operating. There he goes. He's off again. I'm not worried about the fact that we're not actually producing anything. At the moment, we need to just keep every single bit to ourselves. Um, because this is going to take some time to actually uh, to do. Um, a lot harder than most games. Okay. So he's collected that. Okay, let's just uh, speed this up because I can't. Analyzed. I can't really do anything at this moment in time um, until we actually. Ooh, is that going to do anything? Sector scan. Anomaly nope. Found. Um, yeah, it's not a great deal I can do while it's uh, collecting resources, etc. Um, and we need to get a few more things up and running. So, I'll see you in a moment. Okay, so we have just uh, researched our first drone swarm, and I've got no active research, so I'm going to choose next uh, the dr low G drive drone for faster drones. Um, we have actually got additional um, um, research things that were un unlocked on the last uh, anom anomaly. Um, actually, do you know what? St scratch that, we're going for that one. We're going for explorer ai so every explorer that we've got is going to give us a hundred uh, research points per sol for the uh, the explorer that we've got so that is going to be giving us a massive boost on our um research sector scan select a sector to scan oh, that was quick right okay so we've now got metal Deposits down here. Where are they? There. Let's go into there. So five, six hundred. That's not great. Six hundred is not great. Okay. 
All right, so let's get that going. Um, we're still collecting resources, and we will continue collecting resources out of each area as soon as we can. So that's kind of what I'm going to be focusing on. So again, I'll see you in a moment. Okay, so we are currently... Um, we've explored a few more areas. Uh, we're now starting to uh, get our water sorted out. So we've got a water source over here. Uh, we need to uh, get our drones to go and do some work. So we've got all this metal that's coming over from um, the deposit. So we're just going to get this all built up. And we're going to connect it to the same power grid, uh, which is Sector only working 50% um, of the time. So it's only working during the night. Uh, sorry, during the night, during the day. So we do not. Is that in the right place? No, it's not. It's in there. And then we can take that one and cancel that one. Oops. Let's pull that back in. There we go. Uh, so we can then put our fuel um, prefab that we've got. And it is production, isn't it? There it is. So we can start producing fuel. And we'll put a fuel depot in right nearby. Once we have fuel, we can then start looking at um, building the... Uh, let's move you out a bit further. You need a bit of concrete, don't you, cold actually? Wave approaching. Alright, so we've got a cold wave coming, which is not great, when we just want to get water running. Uh, we need some concrete, don't we? So let's just get some concrete here. And let's allocate you to go and pick up a load. So we only need a few, don't we? So there we go. So we only need six. So, so they can deal with what they need out of that. Perfect. You can go get charged up again. And then that will be built. Perfect. What you need now? You need machine parts. Okay. Let's get some machine parts available. Move you back. And you go pick up those what you need. Uh, actually, what am I doing? Think about this. So I want just machine parts. So let's just go and collect. How many machine parts do we want? We want five. So let's press control. And go and pick up five machine parts. Go on. There we go. Now go offload over here. And you can actually uh, make our water. And just in time for the cold wave to hit. That's good, isn't it? That's just perfect. Just wonder whether we get more damage uh, during a cold wave. Right, look at that. Wow. The whole map. Wow, okay. <laughs> Send you back over here to charge. So that's not working because we've got no um, heat around it. So that's fine. I wonder whether we can actually see a little bit clearer now the surface deposits. No, we can't. That's a shame. How are we getting on with our scanning? So couple more to do I do like this cold wave bit I think that's pretty good so it lasts for five days Wow okay this is gonna be harsh to say the least Wow okay so let's go back to map we've got no metal no deposits in Sector there scanned. <laughs> I've got nothing in there We've got just water, we've got 25 metal, 14 metal. Okay, so that's not good.
Let's get him up here now. I think that's it. Yeah, yeah, I thought so. Oxygen can be extracted from the atmosphere by a mode since it's crucial for your survival for future colonists. An oxygen tank for storage highly recommended. Pipes are used to connect. Yes, I know, thank you. But to be perfectly honest, I'd like my robots to survive and they don't use water yet. Uh, oxygen yet. Okay. All right. So what we've got so far, we've got 84 concrete, we've got 21 polymers, 9 machine parts, and 5, sorry, 9 electronics and 5 machine parts. Okay, what do we need for a dome? Basic dome is 20 metal, 80 concrete, and 10 polymer. So we can build that at least, but we need to have our dome somewhere like that. So we need to build that here. I mean, we can drop that. Yeah. We can drop that there. Okay, so that's going to need quite a bit. Sector scanned. Come on. Vehicle battery low. I know. Offload and get you charged. Sector. Okay, so we do have some valuable metals in here. But that's it. Wow. Okay. Get charged up. It's actually interesting that. Uh, these things don't work in the cold. Wow, okay. That's really interesting. I, th I thought it was only water that actually froze in the cold spell. So this is going to be extremely difficult then for us. Because we know these don't work. At all. Alright. Alright. How are we doing on our research? So we are 1500. Yeah, so it's going to be a few more days before we get our robot research um, or our explorer AI research, and then we can go on to faster drones. Um, yeah, I might have to go and for this Mars crowdfunding as well. Uh, for the next rocket that I bring up here uh, because otherwise I'm not going to have many resources oops collect right. uh, it's actually quite interesting here is actually thawing quicker than lower so that's good. So hopefully if we build stuff up here, it will be uh, a little bit more beneficial to us. Because we can put domes and everything up here after having a Sector tunnel built. Scanned. No resources, nothing in there. That is just ridiculous. Okay, do you know what we can do is... Uh, let's put, uh, we want 80, don't we? Do you know what, I'll just use the, the rover. So he's picking up metal. How many metal do we need? 20. I hear banging in the background, and I think that's to do uh, asteroid hitting, but... Yeah. Can't see them. Cable fault reported. Okay, can you reach? Yes, you can. Now, this is a frustrating bit with uh, cable faults. I mean, it's a cable. I'm not driving on it. Well, I tell a lie. I've got an explorer sat on top of it. But why does it break? It's one of the things I liked about one of the later uh, researches. 
you basically have um, uh, indestructible and instant cables which I quite like right you're ready so you can now travel down here and deposit that right next to here for me so we're gonna need to make sure that we have sufficient power stored to last a few days uh, I say five days um, and to be able to heat up uh, the water that we need for our uh, dome uh, for any con lists let's go and collect a load of concrete um, and then we also need uh, 10 polymers don't we he's charging that's good No power there, so let's just go and drop off. Okay, so ten polymers. Let's pick up. Scanned. Anomaly found. And we've got another anomaly. Perfect. Oops. Now pick up concrete and you go and have a look over here. Let's pick you back up. So you got 30, excellent. Oh. So we've got 20 metals, 22 concrete. Need a few more trips. 42 concrete, so we need another 30 plus. Let's pick up the concrete from there. Oops. You can pick up one concrete from there come on let's go and drop off again breakthrough discovered cloning great okay let's bring our explorer back before his battery goes flat because that was quick so come on offload So one more load of concrete would be uh, sufficient. Research complete. What are they doing? It does my head in the way they keep moving things. Where are you getting the concrete from? Over here, okay. Well, that explains where it's coming from. Alright, let's get a bit more. Vehicle battery low. Okay, we have to wait then until it's charged. Sector scanned. Oh we've got a bit more metal. Excellent. So where's that? So that is Oh there. It's no, hang on. E9. Okay, ah, perfect to the top. Excellent. Ah, I knew I could hear meters. Cool. Alright, okay, so that's good. We've got another 20 hours for this cold. So let's get you down here. 
Now we want the pipes and the um, electricity to be installed sooner rather than later. So let's get that connected. They can start building it. And then we'll get our uh, electricity sorted out as well. Take that down. Perfect. So we just need some more metal to put down here, which we can find up here. And we need our dome just to highlight those metals. There we go. So we've got 21 in this area. Oops. Go back to our map. 60 odd in here in total. That's a oh, that's a nice little uh, collection there. Reported. Oh dear me, where are you? Ignore that. Which I can't ignore it thinking about it because I haven't got drones covering the whole area. So where's that cable fault? Okay, so it's not underneath there. It's there. Okay, well at least I had a drone in that immediate vicinity. I'm going to add, uh, move a couple of these drones back to the shuttle. Because that shuttle has got the greater capacity. And these guys can come down here and work a bit closer. Now we want to have storage of... Let's do an universal storage depot there, that'll be fine. Uh, you, 21, th nearly 30. So you're going to start pinching my metals from here to build this lot, but that's life. That's life. Let's find you, you've stopped, so go and get some more. Cold wave is slowly subsiding. And that is not working. Why are you not working? It requires some maintenance. That's just just wonderful. Okay. So I get it built and straight away I need another machine part. And do I have one? I have one machine part. I have two there. Okay. So right, okay. We can send this guy over here in a moment. So well, let's get you going over here now. And we have a nice little cyclone. Don't think those actually do a great deal to us. Um, where are you? Come on. Just go over and do that job. You can come and drop off here. And they'll be in a good vicinity for our uh, drone dome to be built. And at the same time, these guys can just get this water up and running so we can start getting some fuel. And we can start loading the rocket to get rid of it. Perfect. <coughs> Thank you for that notification. But we've got water. So that's brilliant, that is. So we can drop you down here. You can go back. Oop, no, hang on. You're not going that far. Let's get you on here and get you charged up. You're getting low as well, Sector so you can go on the, there. There. Get in charge, perfect. And you can come down here. Come on, keep coming. It's like a sensor. Yeah, that's sensor. So these drones are just gonna get on and start building the, the first dome. We won't have uh, any colonists being able to move in there just yet. Because we've got too much else that we need to do. do that. I want you to load resources. Come on. Thank you. So where are you? You're there. We still have got no more anomalies. Mm. Okay. Let's 
So we've got everything that it needs down here to be built, which is good. And we are producing fuel. Excellent. So we need 60 fuel. Wow. Wow, that's a lot of fuel. nearly there and you're nearly full as well now when an asteroid hits you can also get more metals and more polymers from it so you kind of uh, not worry you shouldn't really worry too much early game uh, for getting metals and polymers um, because the polymers that you need early on, you're not going to need that many. Milestone achieved. We have an oxygen shortage. Yeah, we have a dome. Now we're going to turn this off actually, so it's not using any power. It's Dust there. Storm approaching. Oh, okay. That's the second issue. Right. Okay. So that's all there. What can I do now? Uh, shall I? If I build any buildings in there. Oh, research hang on. Complete. Let's get some more research done. Okay, so uh, drone hub controls drones. Uh, it's going to cost me 2,000 research. It means I don't have to buy a drone hub, which is kind of useful. Um, should I go for faster resources? Uh, more cargo. Oh, this is interesting. S cloning vats creates clones over time. Oh, that's a spy a fire I've not seen. So that'd be interesting. Um, that needs quite a lot of metal, uh, polymer, and electronics. So cloned colonists grow twice, grow and age twice as fast. Hmm. Okay. That could be a problem, so I'm not worrying about that just yet. Um, RC rover no longer needs to recharge, starting with four drones with a command limit. Ooh, okay, that's an interesting one. I've not seen that one before. Um, I have a feeling I'm going to go for this one. If I can build it, then it's going to be a case of... And I'll put that as a secondary. If I can build it, it means I don't have to ship it. So that'll be good. Right, uh, what are we doing? Where's my rover or transporter so you're there so let's go and drop off so we've got um, a dust storm on its way now it's going to be fun uh, what's going on here warning too far from drones uh, not producing due to a lack of demand okay that's good we're not wasting energy on anything because it's only demanding as per this refinery which is good right let's go and get our remaining metals and go from there right okay we've uh, achieved quite a bit um, on the start of the game uh, we've uh, we've got our rocket Anomaly Ooh. found. Let's just pause that. We have got our um, basic amenities, or a uh, basic amenities, basic production facilities built. We have a dome built, but we can't really start manning it until we can actually afford to build uh, some storages around it. So we need oxygen storage, we need water storage, because we will get some cold uh, snaps, and then also we need a heat around it. So we need. What do we actually need? So uh, we need um, ch -ch 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 life support. So we need oxygen tank. We need a water tank. So that's metal and that's metal. So we can build those without problems. 
Um, we also need a heater. And where are you? You're not there. I have to research you. Oh, no. Okay, so that's going to be interesting. That's going to be very interesting. That is not good at all. Uh, I do not have the research available to protect me from the cold. Oh, no. Right, okay. I think that's... Uh, a good place to stop this episode thank you very much for watching if you've liked what you've seen hit that subscribe and until next time that's murphy out <laughs>